Hey friends, what's up? Kaz here. Welcome to a setup tour. I thought I'd go over this pretty quick because I get asked this quite a bit and taking a little break from tutorials. So hopefully you guys are enjoying your Saturday. Here we go. The computer is the heart and soul of this whole setup. It is custom built by me. The only original part from when I started the build three and a half years ago is the processor. processor. It is an i7-3770, you got 16 gigs of RAM and a 512 Samsung SSD, as well as an AMD Radeon R9 390X. It is fantastic, I love it, it's a workhorse and it's powered by a 1000 watt power supply. I have a Logitech Driving Force GT for a steering wheel and pedals combination. Nothing amazing, It was I think it was about 150 bucks new. I definitely did not get it new, but it works great for what I do. We have a Logitech C920 webcam that I use and it is fantastic. And then that projects onto my custom made, homemade green screen, which is just green felt hung on PVC pipe from the ceiling from hooks, so it makes kind of a curtain and the fact that it's felt I don't have to spend a ton of money on lighting to make it to show up right because it does absorb the light very well. I do however have quite a bit of lighting set up but it didn't cost me too much. I had these tree lights just sitting around that I wasn't really using. I just got some daylight bulbs in them. I bounce them off the ceiling. That's like my key light so it's the brightest light and then I have this 160 bulb LED daylight uh, for my fill light. It's dimmer so you, it highlights the other side of my face. Then I do have a very tall 160 bulb daylight LED as well and that's what I use for back back light. I don't really need all those lights but they do help make the image more crisp especially that backlight really takes away some of the green glow. I run an Alesis four channel mixer, USB mixer. I have two XLR inputs and two quarter inch inputs. The microphone that I'm running into it is an ADK model TL1. It is a large diaphragm condenser mic and it is very sensitive, which works really good. I have a headphone amp for when I used to record with multiple people, then we could all hear what was going through the USB mixer. It worked fantastic for knowing your own levels. My headphones, which I love, Love. I have an Audio, Audio Technica like MT55X or something, I think. They are super comfortable and s very clear. And then on the wall, I have some materials on the wall for uh, sound absorption. I'm in a room with not a ton in it, so it helps a lot for cutting down an echo, especially being in the corner. And then it helps a ton to have my green screen that reduces a lot more and absorbs a lot more sound so that it doesn't bounce around and it sounds really nice. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that quick setup tour. This is Cos reminding you guys all, enjoy the game. God bless.